Hi guys, good morning and happy Sunday. Welcome back to my channel, Couponing with Kayla. So we are outside of the Walgreens this morning. We're about to head in here and check out some deals. I'm gonna walk you guys through the deals in the store. Plus I'll have a printable list below the video. So you can print that out, take it to the store with you and it's gonna help make your shopping trip super easy. Now, if you are new to my channel, welcome. I'm so happy that you're here. I hope that today's video is helpful for you. And if it is, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below so you don't miss any new ones. We're gonna get in here. We're gonna look at newbie friendly deals, spin boost deals all of that good stuff let me know down in the comments below if you got a spin booster to work with this week let me know if you like those newbie friendly deals that I showed last week in my video for Sunday um, I tried to like you know switch it up a little bit do something a little different and a lot of you guys seemed like you found it helpful so hopefully you did um, but yeah I hope that you guys are having a great weekend or a great week depending on when you're watching I've been having a good you know Friday and Saturday and everything um so summer is almost over here in our area school's gonna start back in about a week i feel like the summer went by way too fast um chloe's birthday is actually the day before school starts again so <laughs> she's looking forward to her birthday but not looking forward to um having to go back to school so soon um and also thank you guys so so much for leaving birthday wishes down in the comments for her um last week i showed you guys um are like little pictures from her party that she had because she had an early party with her friends and then I also uh, posted like our P.O. box so if you want to send her a card or anything or if you want to leave her wishes uh, for her birthday down in the comments below I always let her know you know what everybody says and everything um, and if you want to send her a card I'll pop up the P.O. box right here again um, her birthday's coming up on the 4th so just a few days away and super excited cannot believe she's gonna be 15 guys she is gonna be old enough to have a learner's permit what <laughs> what <laughs> um anyways but enough about me my life all of that and everything let's get in here let's check out the deals and see what all we can pick up this week <laughs> All right, y'all, we are gonna get into the deals. We're gonna start off with a really good hair care deal that we got a really high value digital for. So the first deal we're looking at is the Love, Beauty, and Planet. So Love, Beauty, and Planet, they're $9 each. You get $5 Walgreens cash when you buy two. And we also got a new $9 digital coupon. So you're going to grab two of these. Your total will be $18. With your digital, you're going to pay $9. You can pay with Walgreens cash. Then we're going to get back $5 in Walgreens cash, making your final cost only $4 for both of these or just $2 each. Next up, we have Nivea Body Wash. So the women's body wash is $6 each. So two of those would be $12. You get $5 Walgreens cash when you buy two, but we don't have any digital coupons for this. So on this one, it's an okay deal, not the absolute best. This one right here, we could grab the men's. They are $5 each, so two of these would total $10. Then you get back your $5 Walgreens cash, making them two for $5. So the men's one is a little bit of a better deal, and you can pay with Walgreens cash. Up, we've got a raw sugar deal. I love when this deal comes around because it includes the three ounce bottles. These are buy one, get one 50% off. So two are gonna total you $5.23 and you're gonna get a $3 register reward for buying two. Makes your final cost only $2.23 for two of these when they're normally $3.49 each. And you can pay with your Walgreens cash on this. Next, we have a deal on the Axe deodorant. So if you wanna pick these up, they're buy one, get one 50% off at $7.49. Two will total $11.23, but we have a high value six off two digital coupon. So your final cost would be only $5.23 for two, and that is without any rewards back, and you can pay with Walgreens cash. Next, we have a Colgate deal. If you wanna grab the Colgate toothpaste or you wanna grab the toothbrushes and mouthwash, they're $4 each this week, so two total $8. We have a three off two digital. You'll pay $5, get a $3 register reward, and it makes these just two for $2 or only $1 each, and you can pay with your Walgreens cash. 
Next, we have a deal on palm olive, and we also have one uh, for the Suavitel, but these are buy two, get a $2 register reward. And on these, I'm gonna go ahead and grab two. My total will be $5.98. We have $1.50 digital, so you'll pay $4.48, but then you're gonna earn back that $2 register reward, making it $2.48 for two. Now, if you have the big bottles of Suavitel at your store, you could grab the big bottle of Suavitel. We have a $2 digital for it, and the big bottle is priced at $5. 99 so if you grab one of those and one of the palm olive for 299 after your coupons and your rewards back you're going to be around 348 for the two which is not bad so if your store has the big suavitel you could do that so next we have the angel soft and the quilted northern they're buy two get a three dollar register reward we do have a one dollar digital for angel soft and we also have a one dollar digital for the quilted northern so if you need some toilet paper you could definitely do a pretty good deal with these now we also have the dixie plates and cups and bowls that are part of this for 6.99 i'm not seeing a one dollar digital on my account but if you had a one dollar digital previously that you didn't use you may still have that available um, they have these big plates they're 44 uh, we have the 56 count of the bowls I like to get the 90 count of the plates but they're out so I'm not going to grab this today but I'll go ahead and show you guys a scenario for the quilted northern and the angel soft if you want to pick it up so these two products right here total $13.98. We have two $1 digitals, so you would pay $11.98. You can pay with Walgreens cash, and you'll earn a $3 register reward, making it $8.98 for both. Or you can switch out one of these for the Dixie plates and check and see if you have a digital for that. Next, we have the Arm & Hammer, an easy deal for buy one, get two free. These are $7.99 or $7.49, depending on which ones you're picking up. And this is a pretty good savings. If this is the laundry soap you like, you're going to get three for that price. And you can pay with Walgreens Cash. So guys, I wanna show you a couple of ways that you can do these deals. If you wanna split them up, you could do the raw sugar first. They're both 523 total. Then we could pay with Walgreens Cash or if you have a register reward from last week, you'll earn a $3 register reward back, making it 223 for those two. Now, the register reward, it looks kind of like this. This is one that I earned last week, but the $3 register reward you earn will look like this. You can take it and use it on your next transaction with the palm olive. So the two palm olive total $5.98 and we have $1.50 digital. But if you're using that $3 register reward, you would pay around $1.48 plus tax out of pocket and you'll earn another $2 register reward. So the final cost is $2.48 for those two, but you pay less out of pocket by using that register reward you just earned. Then you can take the $2 register reward you earn on the palm olive and use it on the love beauty and planet or whatever other deal you would like to these two products total $18 we have a $9 digital and you can use your $2 register reward from the palm olive you would pay $7 you could pay with Walgreens cash if you have it then your final cost on that one after $5 Walgreens cash back would be $4 so overall you would get all six of these products for only $8.71 plus tax but you can pay less out of pocket by splitting them up and using those register rewards for from one transaction to the next but this is just the physical breakdown of it if you like to see a visual and I will have these deals on the printable list as well but not a bad deal if you want to grab those items for less than ten dollars but you don't want to use a spin booster now guys this is everything that I am going to grab today I actually might add one more item but we'll see anyways these are the register rewards that I earned on last week's deals and I'm going to use these not that one <laughs> not the cereal coupon but I'm going to use all of these to help lower my out-of-pocket costs so I'm hoping to pay very little out-of-pocket and use my digital booster of spend 45 get back eight dollars Walgreens cash but again we're not going to actually pay 45 dollars out of pocket after manufacture coupons on the digitals and our register rewards so let's go ahead and head to check out all right guys so this is my total with tax and she's scanning in my manufacture register rewards that i had from last week i'm going to say no on the donation since i already donated on my other one and then all of our digitals are coming off once all those digitals come off that is when you're going to see how much i'm paying out of pocket including tax so I'm paying $11, that's including tax. All right, let's go home and see our final cost.
All right, y'all, we're back in the car from Walgreens. I feel like that's the smallest Walgreens haul that I've done in a while, but it went really, really well. I believe all the digitals came off. I think I got all my rewards. I'm gonna double check and everything, but everything went really smoothly, so I was really happy with the transaction. Um, I had a couple questions last week, so I just wanted to answer those now uh, for anybody if they didn't see or anything. Um, with register rewards now, I know that I have my Walgreens video Video where I kind of you know tell how you can do your couponing at Walgreens and break it all down and everything but there have been a couple of changes over the past you know what year I would say and with register rewards now when you are going to check out and I showed you guys all those register rewards I was going to use to help lower my out-of-pocket cost it used to be that one coupon would attach per item so you would calculate if you had any paper coupons digital coupons and then register rewards you couldn't have more coupons than you did items but now it doesn't seem that the register rewards attach to a certain item anymore so if I have five items but I have seven register rewards and I'm using some digital coupons and everything it will still let those apply so I will show you guys in detail on the receipt uh, once we get home but I did have more coupons than I had items and everything still went through just fine um, just like it did last week but I did get a few questions on that like hey is it not you know attaching to something anymore and it's not it seems weird because we were so used to that for so long you had to be very very meticulous when you're doing your Walgreens couponing and making sure that you have an item for each coupon and all of that but yes um the way that it is working now it is letting you use multiple register rewards to lower your out-of-pocket costs there without having filler items and all of that so let's go ahead let's head home let's go over the receipt and let's talk final cost of everything that we are picking up today all right guys so i am back home and this is my walgreens haul for this week i know it's a smaller haul but honestly you guys it turned out so well so i'm really really happy with it and i'm gonna go over the receipts with you guys and talk final cost now i do want to say i have one item here as you can tell that was not um, something that i showed in the store but i'm going to show you guys why i picked this up um i felt like it was a pretty good savings and then it got even better which you'll see here in a minute but um so the i don't know if you say CeraVe or how you say it exactly but this one right here i grabbed this because in the store it showed $19.99. I scanned it on the app and it was showing that it was on sale for $15.99. I had the cashier price check it to see if it was actually $15.99 in the store because sometimes the online prices and the store prices will vary. Um, and it was on sale for $15.99. And we also had a $3 digital coupon for this. So I went ahead and grabbed it because I have not seen this big bottle like this at my store before. Let me just show you guys. So normally I will get this one right here it's the eight ounce bottle and I really like this product I feel like it's good for sensitive skin and also um, this bottle right here lasts quite a while so this one is double the size it's a 16 fluid ounce so just for comparison I just wanted to show you guys this bottle right here this one is $16.99 in the store. The last time I got it, it was buy one get one 50% off and we had a coupon um, and that's why I bought it last time plus I had like an online promo code. Um, but so this one right here, normally $16.99. This big bottle right here, this one, double the size, was $19.99 in the store. I've never seen this big bottle at my store before so I was like, wait a second, okay. Um, this is a much better deal. Anyway, so I just want to show comparison, double the size there, $16.99, $19.99. Now on sale, this one's $15.99. I think this one's on sale for like $12.99, something like that. Anyways, um, so here's my receipt on this. It was $15.99. We had a $3 digital. Um, I did make a donation there, so uh, my total is a little different. But overall, my final cost was $12.99 plus tax for that big bottle um, and I paid with $10 in Walgreens cash. So I really only paid um, with tax and everything like $5 out of my own pocket, okay? Um, so there's that. Um, just wanted to show that one. 
And like I said, I wasn't sure if I was going to include it in my haul, but it actually worked out nicely for me. So before we continue with the deals, I'm sitting here, I'm drinking my iced coffee in my cute little cup that I got from Joanne Fabrics. And it's time to announce the winner of the $20 Walgreens gift card. Thank you guys so, so much to everyone who entered to win in last week's Sunday haul video. And the winner is going to be right here on the screen. Congratulations. And again, thank you so, so much much to everyone who entered. If this is you, make sure that you send me an email at couponingwithkayla at yahoo.com to claim your gift card and we will do another giveaway very soon. So you guys keep on watching and that way you don't miss any great deals or any new giveaways. And let's go ahead and get back to the deals. So for my main transaction that I did today, I was doing the digital booster of Spin 45, get $8 Walgreens cash. I did not have a paper booster to stack with that. If you have a paper booster to stack, it's even better. But recently I've not had any paper boosters printing for me. So let me know if they've been printing for you because I used to get those a lot, but lately it's not been printing out. So let me know. But on this transaction, I was at 45 before any coupons, before any tax. Now, I was a little over 45 actually. I think my total was around like 48, something like that for everything except for this CeraVe. Um, so on this transaction, um, after all of my coupons, I was left to pay about $28.94 out of pocket. But let me show you what I did on mine. You can see all of my items. And then right down here, you're gonna see all the coupons. So all these coupons that you see at the top here, these are all manufacturer register rewards I earned last week that I turned around and used on this week's transaction. So that's $22 worth of register rewards. And like I was telling you guys in the car, you no longer have to have a item for the register reward to attach to. So for example, in this transaction, we had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 items. Um, I used how many register rewards? One, two, three, four, five. I used six register rewards, and then we had digital coupons. Uh, so seven, eight, nine. Okay, it's just a coincidence that the amount of items and the amount of coupons match up on this. Even if I had more items, I could still use multiple register rewards. So kind of ignore that. But anyways, um, so I had all those register rewards that I used, and then I had my digital coupons for nine dollars off the Love Beauty and Planet, six dollars off of the Axe. $3 off Colgate and $1.50 off of the Palm Olive. So I only had to pay $6.94 plus tax out of pocket on this. So I went ahead and paid with my PayPal debit card. Now on this transaction, if you're not using all those manufacturer register rewards to lower out of pocket costs, after your digital coupons, you would be left to pay $28.94 out of pocket. Now that's not too, too terrible, it's a little high out of pocket, but like I said, any register rewards that you have, manufacturer register rewards that you can lower your out of pocket costs, definitely do that, and that way you're paying a little less. Um, it says in coupons, I saved 41.50, in Walgreens savings, saved 10.46. So, it didn't print out on the bottom of my receipt how much Walgreens cash I got back, so I check on my account, right, and I was expecting $8 Walgreens cash for my spend 45, get eight, and I was expecting to get back um, $5 Walgreens cash for the Love Beauty and Planet, okay? So a total of around $13 in Walgreens cash is what I expected to get. Um, plus you get a few cents, you know, here and there for your um, everyday Walgreens cash. So probably would have got back around like $13.48 or so on the transaction. I checked my Walgreens cash, you guys, to see how much I got back on this transaction. And it said I got back $33.48 in Walgreens cash on this transaction. And I was like, what? And then I realized that I had one of those monthly boosters that's actually gonna expire in like three days. So that monthly booster was spend $30, I believe four times, and then you earn back $20 in Walgreens cash. Well, I guess this was my fourth time spending 30, but as you guys saw, that's spend 30, you know, before your manufacturer coupons, because I definitely didn't pay that much out of pocket. On this transaction, I got that extra $20 in Walgreens cash, you guys. So a total of $33.48 back, plus I got back my register rewards, I got back my $2 for Palm Olive, 
$3 for the raw sugar, so that did work, no problem. Um, just like I thought it would. I kind of mentioned that in my uh, Mustard Deals video that I thought those might be included. So anyways, um, then also $3 on the Colgate. So overall on this transaction, I came out completely free in a $12.54 moneymaker. If you don't have that, um, extra $20, you're still coming out around $7 or so for all these items, which still was a really great deal. And that's what I had planned on today, but then had that extra booster and it turned out amazing. So free and a $12.54 moneymaker for all those items. And I got this product that I wanted on that separate transaction that was $12.99. So if you subtract my $12.54 moneymaker, that means that all of this cost me a big old 45 cents, you guys. And I'm so, so happy with it. I paid very little out of pocket today. Um, I paid $6.94 out of pocket plus tax on my regular transaction and $5 out of pocket on my other transaction. So around, around 12 bucks out of pocket today overall. But to get all of this for 45 cents, I'm so, so happy with that. So let me know down in the comments below if you're going to grab any of the same deals. As always, I appreciate you guys for taking the time to watch this video. I hope that it was helpful for you. Grab your money-saving apps and your free printable list down in the description box below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs> Little sleepyhead just woke up. <laughs>